Hi everybody, Golden Era Bookworm here, and today we're going to be looking at a Silver Era superset method for developing a super chest, such as the one shown here from the one and only Abe Goldberg, who I have featured several times on this channel already. I mean, Abe Goldberg possessed one of the most impressive and massive chest developments in both the Silver Era and bodybuilding history, period. Just look at this collection of favorite images of mine of Abe Goldberg. Not only did the man have an enormous barrel-like chest due to his enormous ribcage, but his chest musculature was equally impressive, so much so that even in my conversations with the great Marvin Eder, Marvin stated that he had never seen such an impressive chest in the history of bodybuilding, and that is saying something. Now I have covered exactly how Abe Goldberg trained for ribcage expansion in the past specifically. However, in this video, we will look at one of the routines he used to also develop his chest musculature, which involved a series of supersets as follows. The first superset was the barbell bench press done with the bent arm pullover. The second superset was incline bench dumbbell presses with decline dumbbell laterals or otherwise known as flies. And the third superset was the parallel bar dip, again done with a flying action this time, the flat bench lying dumbbell lateral or fly. The thing is that back then in the silver era, just so you understand, a lateral, any motion that was lateral for the deltoids or for the chest was referred to a lateral. If the movement was going away from the body, it was basically called a lateral. But nowadays we would call any motion for the chest that is lateral a fly. Note that for each of these supersets, Abe Goldberg incorporates an exercise that works the muscle first via contraction and extension, and then a second exercise that works the muscle and the breathing action of the ribcage. And in essence, doing this, he works both the ribcage and muscular development. Pretty ingenious. In incorporating a breathing exercise as well, you don't just get the benefit of expanding the ribcage, but the forced air facilitates recovery between supersets. Now looking at each of these supersets, the first being the barbell bench press superset with the bent arm pullover. You want to perform the barbell bench press with a wide grip. This is Abe Goldberg's recommendation, performing eight repetitions, and then immediately go to exercise two, which is the bent arm barbell pullover. Lifting the weight from the chest with a close grip and arms bent, pull the weight down behind your head in an arc-like fashion, breathing in, and as you breathe out, bring the weight back over the chest, and you want to repeat this for eight repetitions. That's one superset. Then you want to perform two more supersets of bench presses and pullovers, and then move on to the next superset. Now, people are going to be asking, how much do you rest between sets and between supersets? I would say it's no more than 30 seconds to one minute to be effective. Looking at the second superset now, the incline bench dumbbell press with the decline dumbbell lateral, or as I mentioned before, a lateral was referred to a fly for a chest movement. For the incline bench dumbbell press, you want to perform eight repetitions and then immediately perform the decline dumbbell fly, as they are called nowadays, by lying on a decline bench. You want to hold the dumbbells overhead and breathe in and bring the arms down until they almost touch the ground. Then breathing out, raise and press the dumbbells back together over the chest and repeat for eight repetitions. Perform two more supersets then of incline bench presses and dumbbell flies and then move on to the last superset. The last superset being parallel bar dips and flat bench lying dumbbell flies. You want to simply perform body weight dips performing as many as possible as this is a final superset but it's a pump like superset it's basically a superset that's going to get your chest engorged with blood you want to pump the chest up as much as possible immediately after performing your set of as many dips as possible you want to perform the flat bench dumbbell fly performing 10 repetitions breathing in on the way down and breathing out on the way up, performing a total of three of these supersets and then you are done.
So I do hope you have enjoyed this look at one of Abe Goldberg's favorite chest routines incorporating supersets for a super chest. And boy, didn't he have a Superman's chest indeed. If you have enjoyed the video, please give the video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't done so, and of course, please leave me your comments and click the bell button to be notified of future videos. That's it from me. This is the Golden Era Bookworm saying bye for now. Now, if you're interested in learning more about Vince Deronda's approach to bodybuilding, his principles, and all these tips of wisdom that he has, I mean, there's so much stuff that probably hasn't been proven by science, and it will take science to prove or disprove uh, Vince, but to be honest, these three books, I believe, which I call the Classic Physique Bundle, are the best books that Vince ever came out with, and they, of course, are the Wild Physique, the Master Series, and the Pro Series. Have a look at it this way. The Wild Physique, I believe, is like the ABCs of Vince Deronda's principles to bodybuilding. He teaches you the exercises and his principles, but how do you put them together? Well, the Master Series is a 14-month program of using all of these principles, all of the diets that Vince came out with, all of the exercises, and believe me, it's a brilliant, brilliant program. Many people have used it. I know I know personally a lot of uh, bodybuilders that have actually used it and uh, f made fantastic results with it. And of course, the Pro Series was a book that he came out with later on, specially targeted for uh, getting into competition. It's just the, these three books, as I call it, the Classic Physique Bundle, uh, Vince's best work, and available, of course, at www.goldenerabookum.com. Now, the Pro Series of Bodybuilding, which was targeted for professional bodybuilders, is a contains six programs, each of which go for two months each, so it's a whole year, uh, again, in preparation for competition. Online training is now available, including my new program, Novice to Classic, a program geared towards beginners and novices looking at developing a classic physique, as well as Classic Cut, geared at those who wish to lose weight and gain muscle fast. Details available at www.goldenerabooking.com. Need a bodybuilding poster for your gym or office? Then check out ironmanmagazinearchive.smugmug.com for the highest quality posters on the planet. Scroll through the galleries of all the legends, including greats such as Arnold, Frank Zane, Sergio Oliva, Serge Nubre, Tom Platt, and Larry Scott, and much, much more, and select your poster now. Your favorite YouTube channel, please visit teespring.com slash store slash golden era bookworm for merchandise, including t-shirts, hoodies, face masks, phone cases, and much, much more. Once again, at teespring.com slash store slash golden era bookworm. Become a patron at www.patreon.com forward slash golden era bookworm for hard to find books, scans of rare photos and articles on the golden era of bodybuilding. To take full advantage of my collaborations, use code GEB20 with nspnutrition.com and vincegeronda.com as well as code bookworm12 at osl.com for a discount at checkout.